When will Kyle Busch make his move on Amarola? How does he make his move? Or will he make his move? Yeah. Amarola pushed him to the win a year ago. That's, they were teammates. They're not Everybody's still in line. Still in line. He'll try no to big jump run. around that 51 no big run. Down the back stretch, getting ready to come into turn number three He's for still the final with turn us. here at still Talladega. With us. We've got a long way to go to the start-finish line. Al Marola in front of Kyle Busch. Back behind him, Sauter. Bring it to the checker. Bring it to the checker. And the 88 still lined of Matt Crafton. Still Are they going to make the move? Here comes Sauter looking to the inside. Al Marola in front of Kyle Busch. Kyle Busch is going to move to still the inside. Keep it's coming. a drag Keep race. Coming. They're three wide at the strike. It looked as though in Kyle the middle Busch there. Get him. outlasted Al Marola. Two thousandths of a second. And one of the things you've always got to realize when you come to Talladega, you cannot go below the double yellow line. I'm not sure who was driving that, but I'm telling you what. What case? That's Rick That's Rick. why he's Kyle Busch. That was amazing. Almirola moved up the racetrack just enough to open it up for the 18. Take a look. He didn't move up as much as he was shoved around, Rick. He's all over the back of that truck. You know he's just driving the front tires. He wasn't driving the back ones. Look at Johnny Sauter diving to the look outside. At, look at Kyle sideways. Unbelievable. Took as the checker out of control. Yeah, look at this. This is going to be a great angle. As they come to the strike. Great shot, guys. Bush goes down to the bottom. Sauter goes up to the top. And right at the stripe. It's amazing. That's Johnny what, Sauter is right at the door of the 51, and he finishes third. That's what two thousandths of a second looks like. I did not know that, bro. <laughs>